New car shopping is so hard, isn't it, Alex? Yeah, you could say that. I'm having the hardest time finding a car that looks like me and says, Hey, that's a car Steve would drive. That's the greatest car ever. I sure hope I can find one. Oh my gosh, that's it! Alex, I found the perfect car! I'm so excited! Oh, thank goodness! We've been out here for ages! Oh, this is perfect! What are the odds that I could find a car like this? See you later! Bye, Steve! Wait! What? Why, why did you take that? I'm so confused! I guess I'll take this one. On the table, we are going to take a look at these simply amazing Minecraft Hot Wheels character cars. If you are ever in the market for a custom Minecraft car, these small diecast vehicles are your choices. We have the Creeper, Enderman, Skeleton, Iron Golem, Spider, and Zombie. Each a fantastic ride from the world of Minecraft. I only have one question. What's inside the Enderman's trunk? That Landry is the mystery we will soon see. And so a little bit closer on the Enderman car, two of six. These Minecraft Hot Wheels character cars similar to the Star Wars vehicles, designed specifically for Minecraft. These are unique and never before seen cars, although many of these take advantage of past Hot Wheels designs in some way or form. Each Minecraft car has character art on the front of the card, which makes it really hard to open, I know. But I just can't be one of those Hot Wheels collectors that have a bunch of carded Hot Wheels stuff on their walls. You have got to open these up. On the back of the card, you can see the collection available. Six to collect. Creeper, Enderman, Skeleton, Iron Golem, Spider, Zombie. Each sold separately, subject to availability, and some super fine print, if that's what you like to see. So let's destroy the value of this car if it has any. The backer card already has a bend. It's worth nothing. Let's remove. And outside of the box, we have this low riding gangsta Enderman car looking very suspicious if this thing is driving around your block. Easily one of my favorite cars out of this collection. Looks to be matte finish with some purple Ender teleport sparkles going around that front wheel well. They really go for it on all design expenses on these fine cars. How low to the ground is this car? And check out those shiny rims. Can we just see what's in the back of that trunk now? Ah yes, the back of the trunk reveal. What do we have in that back storage that is so important? But of course, dirt grass blocks. Oh man, I was hoping for that golden acorn finally. It doesn't look like the trunk will close because of the size of the block. Here's something cool, on the bottom of the car we have an Eye of Ender. And it looks like, what do we have here, DXT23 Enderman, made in Thailand, 2017. Very spiffy vehicle. Okay, skeletons have gathered nearby for the opening of the skeleton car, three of six. Wait a minute, why is there a killer rabbit down there? The world may never know. So let's remove this skeleton car from package. And there it is, the skeleton car looking very bony. Notice the front bumper is a bow, the main weapon of choice of a skeleton. Looking very Formula One racing-like, possible bottle opener in the back with that weird spoiler. Going off the gray and white design of the Minecraft skeleton, I would imagine a race car built from bone would actually go pretty quick, it'd be light, and might be able to sustain a small crash. Anything on the bottom of this vehicle? Look at there, we've got a bone. Which makes sense. Kill a skeleton, it would drop a bone. This back end of the vehicle almost looks like it would attach to some sort of launcher too, but I think that's just how it looks. Very nice, low-profile vehicle. I could see a skeleton zipping around pretty quickly in that car. Or I guess, rabbit. Jeepers Creepers, it's the Minecraft Iron Golem 4 of 6 character car. 
Looks like a vehicle you would find in the back roads somewhere off in the country, and would probably then run from it, and we will remove. This vehicle is so iron golem, bulky, big, stony, iron-like. Looks like we have a forklift on the front. I wonder if it actually works. Ooh. We could actually move those up. Spiky dangerous. That's a little fun extra to this car. Whoa, check out the iron golem tailgate. That is nice. And it looks like in the back of that truck bed we have an iron ignit just sitting in there. It's gonna be stuck, you're not gonna be able to remove that. On the bottom here, we have a poppy as well. I love how each vehicle has something that uh, the character would either have or drop, uh, that sort of thing. Very nice detail. Interesting with some possibly maybe iron golem eyes too on the windshield there on the sides. Next up, five out of six, Spider. I have been really itching to open up this one. There we have the Spider truck, certainly the largest of the vehicles. Looks like we have eight wheels on this thing, similar to a Spider with eight legs. Same thing with the front, multiple eye points. This thing certainly feels like a Spider looking at you from a Minecraft cave. A very hulking vehicle. Looks like on the back we have some sort of action feature flip down thing. Let's check it out. Ah, looks like the spider car also works as a transport. Oh, and this is too perfect. Bringing out the skeleton car again. We have a spider jockey now. Skeleton riding spider and it fits perfectly. Look at that, just right on the back there. Even a spot for the bow to fit. I doubt the other ones will fit so perfectly. So that's a combo of cars you will not want to miss. The spider hauling the skeleton. The last vehicle before we look at the first vehicle, the Hot Wheels character cars, Zombie 6 of 6. Looks to be a nice station wagon. What better way to transport zombies around? There's lots of seats back there. And a zombie outside and up close. This might be the first time I've ever noticed a car wearing a shirt and pants. Or is that just the paint? Again, what a perfect vehicle choice for the zombie. I would say you could fit at least 10 zombies inside this car. Again, with the paint job, really nice touch. Almost makes me want to buy a station wagon and paint it up like this. That would be a riot to drive around town with. Looks like we have some sort of souped up engine and some sort of windscreen protection. This thing could ram through a fight pretty well. What do we have on the undercarriage of this thing? Ah, uh, of course, rotten flesh. That makes sense. Which reminds me, I think we forgot to look at the bottom of the spider. Ah, uh, spider string. So the zombie car rounds out the collection to six, but we're still gonna go back to one here in just a second. And now we near the end with the beginning, the Hot Wheels character cars, Minecraft Creeper, one of six. Well, that saves me a few seconds of opening. And the Roadster-like Creeper vehicle outside of the package. Certainly a very iconic vehicle choice for a Creeper. If you peer inside under that hood, you can see some TNT. That's gotta give it some pow. Very Bone Shaker-esque. Looks like in the back bed there we have some gunpowder. Kind of right on the back there, hard to see. Perfectly painted with your Creeper camouflage. Although this vehicle does look pretty noisy, I don't think it can sneak up on you as well as a real creeper could. Good looking front face to this thing. On the bottom of the car, a gold disc it looks like. Good for cave music, metallic sounds, creeper burps, that sort of thing. Good looking creeper vehicle, anyone want to take it for a spin?
And there it goes. And there you have it, the six Minecraft Hot Wheels character cars. What do you think about these awesome Minecraft-inspired vehicles? Oh look, it's Barbie Reportington! These are some pretty, sick vehicles. I would love to drive them around town. Tell the world. Oops, excuse me. Wow, what a rare treat. Minecraft Hot Wheels Character Cars appears on store shelves fall 2017. Collect the Creeper, Enderman, Skeleton, Iron Golem, Spider, Zombie for around $4.99 apiece. If you enjoy riding around in Minecraft World vehicles, this collection is for you. A little more comfortable than a standard minecart. Each diecast vehicle customed with ultra quality. Pick one up today, just don't talk about what the Enderman is hauling around in his trunk. That's what I have to say about that. The Ender Squirrel would have a golden acorn and trunk. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please, like, share, subscribe.